Welcome hikers to uh, Guide of Walks New Zealand and uh, my name's Graham. Kia ora, my name's Kahu. And we're going to be talking a little bit more about this particular plant here. This is the bracket fungi. Now it's quite old this plant. Um, if you uh, see it, uh, you can see that it's uh, one, two, three, four, four years old. Generally that's how it's um, aged. Uh, by uh, Very similar to the trees, how you count their rings, you can count the wrinkles on this. This particular fungi appears on trees that are dead. Now you might uh, have a look up on the trees here, they've still got a lot of green foliage on. But uh, they appear on trees that are dead, they don't create a dead tree, they actually clean up a tree after it's died. Uh, so what they do is put a whole heap of little fingers into it, like little pieces of cotton, and that uh, then uh, sucks out all the nutrients. A wee bit like um, taking uh, something that's attached to your body, and um, the first thing it's going to start sucking out is the nutrients from the extremities. And that's why we see at the top of these trees have got no hands on them at all, they're all stuck. A lot of, uh, there are a lot of uses of this plant, but the early Māori um, that were settled in New Zealand, you can imagine down here it's very, very cold, very rainy, very wet, very hard to start fire. Um, and without fire you don't have life. So what we would used to do is we'd take this guy here and we'd put him in the fire. And what he does, he doesn't actually burn, but he creates an ember, a burning ember. And then it was placed into either a flax or an astelia basket, uh, something fibrous so it doesn't burn through. And you'd walk from one campsite to another, controlling the airflow going through so it doesn't burn through, but it doesn't go out. When you get to the next campsite, you'd spin it around your head, it'd light up, and you've got the beginning of your fire. And it was always the woman's job to do this because they were seen to be the givers of life and the keepers of warmth. And that brings us to the end of this subject. And uh, if you want to learn more, you can go to our uh, Guide Walks New Zealand YouTube channel. And I'll catch you again. Bye.